Hey, 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 what's up, you guys? Chicken Bone here playing Ark Scorched Earth on the Pooping Evolved server. And um, today I want to build what was going to be the chandelier, which is now not a chandelier because it's going to look better if it's not a chandelier. That's what we're building today, uh, kind of like just what's hanging up there. Uh, the second level, and it's not going to serve any purpose, it's just going to be there, it's going to look nice. But first I've got to show you guys what I did. Uh, I finished these fridges, I've got four fridges now. They're kind of sticking out of the roofs here, but you know, I'm fine with it. Because there's a little gauge on it. And the gauge is sticking out of the roof, so you know, whatever, I'm fine with it. we got an industrial cooker sitting in here, which was a pain in the butt, but it's in there. And we got some water here, which we can't access, so I made another water tap, which we can access and put our uh, thing in, canteen. We got some preserving bins. We got the cooker right here, the industrial grill, and in the background we got our refining forges. Um, yeah, it's kind of a shame that this wall had to be turned this way. It cannot be placed like the other ones, but, you know, arc. So... We just did it this way, and it's starting to come together pretty neatly. I mean, look at this place. This is awesome. This is just amazing. Now, this, this area right here, these three rows of uh, foundations are reserved for storage boxes. We're going to have a pathway right here, just like, just like this, really. This is three rows, and there's going to be storage boxes on either side, as many as we can possibly get in there. So that's this part, and then we got this whole huge deal here which is probably gonna be the living room or something I mean I would love to get a mod for this I would love to have a mod for decorations and stuff but you know this is art vanilla so no mods for decorations um yeah we're, we'll probably like put beds everywhere I don't know yet we'll find out but today we are building this thing um I like to call it the chandelier because it looks like it's hanging from the ceiling which it is, because it's hanging from those two walls up there. Uh, but uh, on second thought, I might bring these guys down to the ground on two sides and kind of have it sit on that instead of having, let's go up here, instead of having it hang from these thatch walls or these adobe walls which are built here, it just doesn't look that great. I just want to have it floating. Like if you're walking on here, I don't want to see anything. I just want to see, like, a balcony everywhere. So, oh god, stupid staircase. So, um, yeah, these guys, these sloped things that go down to this level, which is going to be railings, um, we're probably going to make pillars out of those. And that's what we're going to do today. It's going to be amazing. Now, if you're wondering how I built this, very simple. Hang two walls, well, three walls, actually. Hang one, two, three walls from that um, third level. If you build the temple, otherwise you can do it in your house, I don't know. If you have a cube, you could probably do it. So make sure you hang three walls down, and then hang a ceiling, or put a ceiling on top of that third wall, which I removed. There was a, there was a wall here at one point. Hang a ceiling, for, or put a ceiling on that. Oh crap, there's no thingy there. Then we got this ceiling, and then you can just build out four by four. And as soon as you've done that, you've got to hang some walls underneath the ceilings where you want to have your sloped roof which is this you want to hang like some walls underneath that so it supports um you know whatever ceiling you want to put out there like this the second row is going to support that you can hang ceilings there and it's all going to support each other up until the point where you delete these walls as soon as we delete these thatch walls or well these adobe walls too um it's going to collapse because the staircase is not like a pillar it doesn't support anything so we're gonna that's why I'm gonna make like the pillars down I think we're just gonna do that like I don't really need this space right here this one foundation or this one on this side I don't really need it so we're just gonna make some pillars actually let's start with that let's let's just get some walls get some walls get some walls get some walls let's do that first let's just make sure that this thing cannot collapse um, it is going to point outwards right Yes. We'll go like this. We'll just go all the way around. Make some big pillars. Yeah, like that. It's going to be amazing. And we can probably place some lighting in there. Um, I'm not sure. I wanted, I've been wanting to test something. I've not done it yet. You remember how we always place omnidirectional lights inside of these pillar things? And then 
there the light kind of travels through all the walls and you you will have like a big light spot in the middle i want to do that but i'm gonna try it with the trophies because these these yellow trophies that we have on the temple i'm gonna kind of adjust the temple these yellow trophies they are so bright you guys you don't need any lighting in the base and this yellow light is amazing looking um i think i'll go trophies and then all the way down uh on the sides like the side we're looking at right now we're gonna go all the way down diagonal in every direction of the temple and then at night it's gonna light up like some kind of i don't know some kind of cross or something I don't know, it's going to look amazing. But I kind of want to place the place the trophies in here too and see if the light passes through walls. Because if it doesn't, then we're going to use Omni Lights. But that's something we're going to do like at the end of the base. At the end of the base, we're going to do all the lighting and stuff. Because it's something you can't really figure out until you have everything in place. So we're just going to fill this up for now. Why are you being weird? Why is it wanting to... Oh, that's because you're not... You're you're being weird. I see how it is. Ah, yeah, I see, I see. Okay, so we're gonna need. No, Ark. That's not the. That's not the way you showed me you were gonna place it. You were gonna go in. That's we 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 want to go in. Hold on. What if we build from down up? It's probably gonna give us a little bit more of a chance to actually go the right way. Let's go like this. No! Ah, uh, there we go. We did it. So, we got one pillar in place. It should hold up everything. Because it's connected to the to the top and it's connected to the bottom. So, in theory, we could clean out the entire top. Now, we're going to just test that. We're going to remove this. That's support number one. We got support number two and three here. And then four and five. Oh, baby. Are right here. The last one's gonna be the tricky one. This is it. Don't collapse. We're floating. We're floating. Yes. It's amazing. We did it, you guys. Okay, so these walls are kind of useless. We're just gonna go. I might keep them like this. I might just seal off all these pillars. It kind of probably looks a lot better, too. Yeah, it might. It might look a lot better. We're gonna keep them in place for now. I, I might do something with that at a later point. I'm just going to keep those. Just don't want to waste any materials if you're not sure yet what you're going to do. Um, right. So, we got pillar number one. Then we want to make the, the little staircase -y thing. Now, if you're going to do it like this, you might as well start at the ground. It's probably going to make it a lot easier. Um, we're going to remove the slope roof here. There we go. Do we have any ceilings? Uh, crap. Don't think so. No, I didn't bring anything because I, I'm stupid like that. Let's see. Ceiling, ceiling, ceiling. Actually, we need some slope stuff, right? No, we don't. Ceilings. Get all the ceilings. Put that there. And then we need a sloped guy. We need several sloped guys. Uh, two of them. Slope. Slope, slope, slope. There we go, slope. And then store all the other crap because it's making us a little bit heavy. Oh, I'm typing. There we go. Okay, we need these, we need ceilings, we need slope roof, uh, walls. I think we're good. I think we're good for, you know, at least the next three minutes. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go, say, ceiling right there. Bam. Then we're gonna go make sure those walls are facing the right way, which is hard. I'll admit, this is not easy. Yes. And, because it's gonna want to snap uh, two ways. This is perfect. Yeah, that's what we want. Okay, so we now have this. Hmm. Okay, now we can pl place our slope guy in there. Like that. Bam. And we're just going to work our way, way around. It's not going to be able to collapse anymore because we built the pillar, so I feel safe doing this. Just building all the way around. This pillar looks kind of neat. How did I get that there? All the way around. We need one here. In there. Oh, baby. Look at how fast we're building today. It never goes this quick. Um, it's probably because I build it out of thatch first, you know? It makes everything a lot easier. Just go. We're, we're just going to make everything Adobe. Oh, baby. Look at the speed. Bam. Yeah. We did it. We did it. It's amazing. Yes. Okay. 
So we've got one sloped side. We need one more sloped side right here. I'm going to replace these walls. Hopefully the right way. Yes. And yes. And one more. Come on. Oh god, this is not this is not right. One more inside, please. Oh, perfect. So amazing. Put this guy in there. Bam. Oh my god, the speed today, you guys. Okay. So we now have our chandelier thing. It's not a chandelier anymore because it's supported by a pillar, but whatever. It's standing on one pillar. I kind of want to get the other pillar down. Um, do we have the walls for that? Did I pick up every wall? I don't think so. I think, yeah, we left some in there. We're good. Okay, we're going to just drag this down because these are facing the right way. So that makes our job a lot easier. There we go. Just drag down like so. And like, uh, no, like that. And then like that. No! Arc. Why? There we go. Oh. And bam. And then we'll just seal it off. Uh, wait, what What are you trying to... There you go, well, that's better. Perfect. Look at this. We got two things. Now, if there's one roof, one ceiling that is incredibly ugly, it's Adobe. Adobe has these, these you know, wooden sticks coming out of the sides, which is such a pain on your eyes like your retinas just burn if you look at it that's how ugly it is so we're gonna use some railings railings kind of cover it up kind of uh, it's better than not having any railings that for sure so what I want to do is I want to get railings everywhere I just want to go all all the way around like this and it's 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 just gonna be a pathway like we're gonna be able to to, to see into the base from above, it's going to be awesome. Oh, this looks so industrial. It's so cool. And we're going to be like this. And then, let's see. See, it kind of covers it up. As I said, kind of. It doesn't really cover it up, but it makes it look a little bit better. So that's, that's the idea here. And we're going to place railings all around this thing. This is going to be perfect like this. Oh, yeah. No! I did that. That was my fault. I won't blame Mark for that one. There we go. Please, last one. There you go. Okay. We're probably going to need a lot more railings. Now, I'm kind of thinking, should we put walls in here or should we put railings in here? It is kind of ugly like it is right now. Like, even if we put railings up here and down there, uh, let's try the corners just to just to have a, have a feel, right? Have an idea of what it's going to look like. Of course, we can't. Let's see. See, it isn't bad, but it isn't really cool either. I kind of want to have walls in there. Um, let's grab a few walls, find out. Huh? Got plenty of walls anyway, so we might as well use them. There we go. Get some walls. Now, I, I can already tell you, I'm probably going to choose the walls. I'll, I'll be honest. Like, that's... We'll, we'll try it. No, we'll try it in the other corner, right there. There we go. Now these walls are gonna have to stick outward. Uh, okay, yeah, that's not. Oh, that's perfect. Like that. If it doesn't do that, then I would. I don't want it. So what if we? Oh god, this is gonna be. This is gonna be a lot of work to get these in. Look how it's being weird. It doesn't. No, it doesn't wanna. Why did you go the other way? But this guy doesn't wanna. I'm definitely not pressing E. That is against my code. My code of conduct. Uh, my code of building conduct says never ever press E. There we go. We just have to kind of like stand on the side here, which I could have remembered. There we go. So this definitely looks a lot better when you're actually here, and then you're gonna have like railings on top of that. Um, definitely a big improvement on the whole. So we're gonna do that. And from downstairs, uh, oh god, who? Oh no, we're floating. There we go. From downstairs, yeah, I guess it just looks like there's another level there, and we still got this gap here, so it's gonna it's gonna be fine. I think it's gonna look amazing, you guys. Yeah, we'll, we should do that. We should just wall it up. It's gonna take a while though, and we don't even have enough walls, I don't think. Let's get some of this. Get some walls. I'm not sure how many walls we need, but we might as well craft a few more. Okay. Okay, we're getting somewhere, guys. We're building super quick today. It's crazy. 
freaking I want to call it the chandelier, but it is not a chandelier. <laughs> um, we can remove these guys because we're not going to use those like that. Then we're going to go oh, that way. Fine, like that. Don't want to mess up. There we go. We'll just hug the wall. No, Ark, Ark did that. Not me. Oh, okay, that was me. Oh my god, Ark. Look, Ark is showing me, right? It's sticking that way. Instead of this way. Uh, it doesn't even want to do it now. And it's going to place it the wrong way, look. Oh, now it worked, fine. Okay, okay, fine. Whenever I show the guys, the peeps that are watching, then you're going to work. I see how it is. There you go. And come on, come on, come on. Bam. I like this pillar here. I like it. I feel like that should stay. We should do something with that. Probably going to look very nice. Can we get... No. Oh, God. The first one's going to be the hardest. Oh, God. Why do you, why do, you do that? You can clearly see that the wood is sticking the other way. And it's just, it, tur it turns it around because it's arc. Arc building for the win. No. Oh my god. Just wasting walls. Uh, uh, there we go, I got it. Wasting walls all the way. I'm going to place all the walls, guys. I won't bore you with that. And then uh, we'll, be we'll be right back. Oh, thank god. Thank God. I only have four walls left. Can you believe that? I have like 50 of them. Or 60. Four walls left. Freaking thing. Anyways. It's in. It. It. I did it. Look. It's all covered up. It looks kind of neat like this. Um, it does look kind of like it's floating. I like it. I like it. See how it's like there's a different level. It's like floaty. Floaty levels. It's amazing. Now we could... We could seal this off entirely on the inside, but honestly, I think it looks fine like this. I think we'll just get our railings. Put those back. Get those. Oh god, we're heavy. Are you kidding me? Put that wood back. There we go. We'll just place the railings on the top level, and then we'll see if we can find any spots where we might improve a little bit. Um, railing or not railing? Not sure yet. Definitely placing them on the sides, though. I like this pillar. I like you. You can stay. I'll, I'll place pillars in the other corners, too. I like it. It's a good idea. Let's get pillars. Before I... I, I can probably... I can't even place them. I, I'll bet you. Because we place walls there. Uh, the other pillar I already placed before we did this build, so... Uh, Ark's probably going to be Ark again, guys. I, I just feel it. Wait, what? It's allowing me... Well, it's allowing me to do this one because it's not touching anything. Now. <gasps> it says okay. It's okay. Ha! Oh, that's amazing. That's amazing. That's amazing what's happening today. Look at that. Haha. -ha. Now, it's a little bit floaty, but... Uh, you know, I'm not going to see it. And if I can't see it, you guys can see it. Okay, deal? I think that's the deal. I think we have a deal, guys. Okay. Let's see. Please. There. There. That. Okay. This uh, this is neat. This is this is good. We're getting somewhere. Um, now, this wall here that we wouldn't remove because maybe future things would happen. I'm still not sure yet. I mean, we can look down, uh, which is kind of the idea. So, it's... Oh, God. Where did that just go? Where the crap did I just place that? What? Look at this random railing. It's just sticking in there. It's not even straight. Oh, God. Ugh. Sometimes. Sometimes, you guys. It's not healthy. Ark is not healthy for you. Okay, so I do want to reel this off. And since we really have this weird thing going on... What if, if, see, if I reel this off, it's gonna, we're not gonna be able to get there. And I can't put a ceiling there, because we'll hit our, we'll bump our heads when we, huh. So this is gonna just have to be open. Just gonna look weird. I don't like this. 
Ha. Huh. Well, well, well. We ran into a little, little OCD problem here. <laughs> I do want to kind of cut this off. It's not like I'm going to ever walk here, but yes. Uh, okay, we'll keep it like this. It looks like the chandelier is kind of finished. I'm still going to call it the chandelier. I don't care what anyone says. It's my chandelier. It's, pr it's beautiful. It's a chandelier on two pillars, okay? That's what's happening. I could have made it a chandelier. It would be ugly. Now it's pretty. I like it. All right. <laughs> Anyways, let's get... Why am I here? Let's get some stuff crafted. Actually, yeah, let's do that. Let's get some obsidian. I'm going to score some obsidian, you guys. I'm going to craft a few trophy things and see if we can place those anywhere. Maybe on the corners. Probably on the corners. It will give off light in the entire corner here. And I think it's going to look amazing at night. So I'm going to score myself some obsidian. Gonna get um, trophy stands crafted. And then I have to sit in a cave for, you know, hours on end to, uh, to get a lot of those yellow trophies. So as soon as I got four trophies, I'll bring you guys right back in and... Uh, Maybe uh, just before nighttime hits, and we'll see how it looks. See you guys in a sec. Alright, and we're back, guys. It is almost nighttime. Um, clock should start running a lot quicker at 8, I think. Um, and I think it's, po it's time to power the base. We should, uh, we should at least get this episode, get some windmills in here, because, you know, I, I really need power in the base. Uh, I need the fridges and all that stuff. Now, if I place... Let's see, I have these little things coming out here, right? All these cross sections. If I place the windmills like this, let's see if we can crouch and then K camera and it's gonna be... No? There we go. If I place it like this, it's gonna point towards the temple. If I turn it around, it's gonna point towards the desert, which would make more sense, but I'm not sure if I can get that second one in there. Because I can snap it to this guy the same way, but it's going to collide with the other one. I'm not sure if I can... I don't think I can fit one in here. So we're kind of forced to face them towards the temple. And since it doesn't really matter... Um, you know, it's not like you're going to get less wind speed because you're facing it the wrong way or something. I think I'll just face them towards the temple. Oh, wait, this is away from the temple. What? Are you snapping to the wrong guy? Oh, it looks like he is. Can we... Oh yeah, this is towards the temple and then we gotta, we gotta keep a close eye on this. How far it's con gonna be. Oh yeah, it's definitely a lot further if we face it away from it. Dang. We're not gonna be able to fit two of them. I mean, we only need one, but I'd rather have two, it looks cooler. Okay, let's do it like this. Bam. We can always replace them if they look like crap. Bam. Look at that. Oh, baby. Are they hitting each other? <laughs> They're hitting each other. It's fine. See how this... Uh, this doesn't make sense. You get, you get my drift, right? Like, the temple is in the way, sort of. I guess. Well, maybe not. Maybe we get a little wind tunnel here. But they're... Turning, we should have 65% wind here, right? It doesn't say. How it, How does it not know? It's not given any power. I, I built the temple here because we had 65% wind chance. 20%? What the crap? So it makes a difference standing here? Here, it doesn't say anything. I've never seen that before. It usually says something. What about here? Yeah, 65% wind, so... They should be on this side. Is that a thing? Did I just waste two windmills? They're not that expensive, so it's not 65. Let's see when it changes. 20. Oh. Well, that's something I didn't notice. So we got 65%. Then we got nothing. No wind at all. And then we go into the 20%. So we need our windmills on the other side. Dang it. I only have two of them. And it's gonna be dark soon. We're gonna see. We're gonna see if our lighting stuff is gonna work. Let's let's make a new windmill. Can we do that? Can we make a new windmill things? Wind. We need twenty cementing base. Right. Uh, we don't have any power in here. So to get twenty cementing base, we're gonna need to like 
fly over to the other chemistry bench. Oh, man. Oh, wait. I, I have cementing paste. There you go. Look at all the cementing paste. Chicken, you have vaults now, remember? Oh, yeah. That's right. There we go. Okay, let's make a windmill. Let's make a new one. We'll just place one for now. Just just to have power. And we're going to need to like do the whole measuring thing again. Dang it. Oh, God. Make me a windmill, man. Windmill. There you go. I can make two of them, but I'm not going to. Turn off. Okay. Okay. It's going to turn dark very, very shortly. Um, we're going to have to find that spot where our electrical cables are. Like, we'll just run around like this. And if there's any cables whatsoever, bam, there you go. It snaps. There you go. Okay, it should go all the way over here. There we go. And that should be an intersection. Let's demolish this wall. Just a little, little, little better look. Okay, so this is our stairs right here. There's intersections all over the place. Uh, I hope these are connected. Sometimes they're not. I hope this is connected. We'll know soon enough, guys. If it's if it's out here and if it's straight, then it's connected. That's all we need to know, man. Um, yeah, it looks connected to me. It's very hard to do it when they're in the in the foundations. You never really know if they're gonna connect. Okay, that's good. Look at that. And then we gotta find out. Is it facing this way? Yes. Bam. Look at it go. It's doing it. It's doing stuff. Excellent. Okay. Please, please, please. If I made any mistakes in in lying in laying these cables underneath the foundations, you know. Oh, baby, look, they're they're powered. We got fridge power. Oh yes. We got. Let's see. Uh, well, no, the industrial cooker doesn't need power. We got chemistry bench power. Yes. We got all the power, you guys. Great success. All right, I got the um, I got the things up there, the trophies, and look at the light in the corners. It's so awesome looking. I'm really, really excited for the night time, which should hit, you know, any moment now. 1957 should hit at eight o'clock. It should go like really fast, in fast forward mode, because you know, if if it's daytime on Pooping Evolved, the the daytimes take about you know two two three hours, and the nighttime is about three minutes. <laughs> Oh man, we gotta get rid of those those windmills though. Like they're kind of just sitting there. I I mean, maybe they can stay. No, no, they can't. Nope. At least we get some stuff back. Yee. All right. I can see the sun's going down. I'm getting excited, and you guys are super excited. We're gonna see all the lighting. Maybe our chandelier will give us some nice light. Our fake chandelier. Uh, and I want to test this guy. I, I have one more trophy, and I want to test what I was talking about before. If I place it inside of the pillar, if it's going to give any light through the walls, it's one of the things I just want to know. So we're going to... I know it does it with Omni Lights, as I said, but I want to know if a trophy does that. So let's place a trophy in here, like that, it's centered. Place a trophy on that. It's going to be super nice in here. Look at that. That is so cool looking. I just want these things everywhere. It's such a nice looking light. Especially with Adobe. And it looks like it's coming through the walls, by the way. I can already kind of see. See how it's kind of getting through? Oh, man. That's awesome. I think I'll get another one for the other side. Now, either it's not centered or this side is just less light. It's kind of weird but it looks awesome I, I really want to want to have another one here all the words man want to want to want to okay son go away should be no it's still slow still slow oh god it doesn't happen until 10 okay look at this we're gonna cut and all of a sudden it's gonna be dark oh baby all of a sudden it's super dark it just happens like it's nothing and Look at that! Yes! Oh, wow. I would call that a great success, especially if we get these things hidden everywhere. I just want to get 
freaking trophies everywhere, you guys. This is so cool. Oh, I like that the ceiling is just lit. Like, maybe the middle parts need a little bit? I don't think so. Uh, let's see. Can we find a staircase in this darkness? Go, go, go. Huh, 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 huh. Don't want to fall off now. Huh. Look at this. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm probably going to place... Place some trophies in the middle here. Like if I place them in the middle up here, it's gonna light probably like the sides here, and it's gonna also light the middle a little bit. But so far, look at this. That looks so cool. Amazing looking, you guys. Well, finally, after after hours of waiting, um, you know, we did it. <laughs> look at that. I'm so dark. I gotta turn around. Boom. We did it. We got light. We got our you know fake chandelier thing. That is. Supported by pillars, and it's amazing. We got power in the base today. We, uh, you know, I think I think the base is coming together pretty nicely. Um, I can't promise for next episode, but probably the greenhouse, an inside indoors greenhouse. It's gonna look so cool. It's gonna be a garden, not like a usual greenhouse. I'm gonna, you know, try and get as many plants in there as possible to have like kind of a garden thing going on, and. Um, yeah, that's probably the next item on the list. But I do want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, please don't forget to hit that thumbs up for me. I would really appreciate it. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, you want to see more of Ark and me playing it. Don't forget to subscribe either, guys. But for now, until next time. Bye.